Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time. People, and today we'll be reviewing the Transformers 2011 Rescue Bots Bumblebee, the very first one they made. This is the first one way before all the other variants from Rescue Bots. Got a nice Autobot insignia. Got some nice paint applications for the car. This thing is amazing. And it rolls very well. But now we're going to get down to some vehicle mode comparisons. Here is the original Rescue Bots Bumblebee I picked up. This one is the probably a newer one compared to this one why not why not we got the chase dinosaur chase i do have a dinosaur bumblebee i'll have to go locate that optimus prime from rescue bots another optimus because we can never get too many optimus primes in my collection heat wave Boulder, and Medics. And I got a lot of these from either the Goodwill Outlet and one I got from the uh, place you would know better as Ollie's. So that's where I got Medics from. Oh, gotta bring Bumblebee back. <laughs> Whoops, my bad. We're gonna locate that last Bumblebee and I'll be back in a flash. Okay, YouTube land, I'm back. I had to walk all the way to the fourth collection room to get this. But that's my last Bumblebee that transforms to compare that to. And now we're gonna transform these, transform Bumblebee into his robot mode. Pull out the legs, split the arms, rotate the hood, of the car around and the head pops out. And this is the best looking bumblebee I have ever seen in the head. So adorable and so darn cute. Forgive me for swearing, but it's literally that cute. And for some comparisons, we're gonna do some comparisons with the other bumblebees here. Here we got Dino Bumblebee because it's precious. It's Bumblebee Precious. And my very first Rescue Bots Bumblebee. This one, not bad, but this one I like a lot more than this one. A lot more paint on this one. Now for some comparisons with the other Rescue Bots. Boulder. Optimus Prime because we like Optimus Prime here on Eddie Hill's Reviews. I love Optimus and I love Bumblebees. Good old Chase. That makes six rescue bots so far. If I can get Heat Wave here, transform. We got Heat Wave, that makes seven. The Monster Truck Rescue Bots Prime. Never go wrong with finding any Optimus Primes. Because as you know, my favorite Transformers are Optimus Prime and Bumblebee. 
And here's Menix for all you Rescue Bots fans. He wasn't shown in Rescue Bots, but he was shown in Transformers Rescue Bots Academy. So, yeah, Menix got his first screen time. And he's the Autobot son of Ratchet, of all things? That's crazy, huh? And I'm so glad to have these in my collection. How many do I own as of this year? I own nine Rescue Bots in my collection. It was a fun cartoon. These robots rolled in, saved people, saved the day. Kind of a different continuity from them battling Decepticons all the time, but it was a fun series, and I loved how they blended in and would never realize that they were Cybertronians in the series. And that's why I will always love Transformers Rescue Bots. I think it's the most funnest cartoon they've done. And I would highly recommend this to any Transformers fan. And this is Eddie Hill. I'm gonna be moving on, but... I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it for all of you. Because all of you is the reason I do my toy reviews is because I enjoy reviewing. I enjoy showing off my toys for my collection for comparisons and showing off my many great collections. And I thank you, all of you who have subscribed to me so far for showing your support here on this channel. You're the reason I keep doing this channel. Sure, I may have correction moments and pausing moments, but I was born autistic, so I technically have some trouble making with speech impediments from time to time and happen to correct what I say. But still, you guys are awesome. Thank you for supporting this channel through the years. And I hope you continue to show your support for the next few years. And as you know, I, I started collecting when I was a kid born in 1993, after I was born in 1993, and I continued to collect to this day, and reviewing was my next step, for all of you who didn't know that. But yeah, thank you for all your support for helping me get up to 381 subscribers. You guys are awesome. And I appreciate your support for this channel. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out, YouTube land.